this martial arts class, you'll discover three variations of a finger roll using your bow staff. Grab your bow staff and follow me. We're gonna jump right into it. The first variation is a one finger roll and you're gonna start with the staff in your hand like you normally would. Now you use the finger roll, it's a transition move or it's just a way to add an extra spin on one side or the other over your head, behind your back, when you're getting ready to throw it up. You'll use it for a lot of stuff when you start to practice flow and freestyle, but not for self-defense, not for fighting. This is for fun. And it's to build strength in your arms and your hands. Great grip strength for grappling, great striking power, defensive power. So start with it in your hand, it doesn't matter which hand, hand closed. As you start to turn down, you're gonna pop these three fingers out of the way. Now you've got it between your thumb, your first finger, and really it's between your middle finger and your first finger. Because I'm gonna pull the thumb out as it continues to turn around and then I bring my hand over and at the end, because it's one finger, I'm gonna push into my hand. That's it, that's the one finger roll. So you're here, you go to those first two fingers, over, push with your thumb. Second finger roll is really three fingers. So what I'm gonna do is start exactly the same way, but then I push it there, two, three, and when I get to the end, here's what's so different about it. These three fingers stay together, and I turn my hand like I did before, and when I come over, I've gotta grab it with my thumb, and then I pop it into the hand. So it's very similar, but I've got three finger spin, and like this one, if I'm, if I'm doing something here, maybe I do a wrist roll to add an extra spin, and then I'm over here, I've got those three fingers, pop it, and then I'm back in. Other hand. So I'm here, my hand's closed like before, those three fingers get out of the way. One, two, three. The thumb assists, I'm back into my hand. Final variation is using all four fingers and the thumb stays out of it this time. This is just a continuous finger roll. use this if you get over here and you start talking too much and you just keep it going or what it, it's not really this is not really gonna be a big part of your demonstration if you're doing this for demonstration this is all about grip strength and hand health just practice that over and over and over again until it starts burning in there you're gonna feel it down in here you're gonna feel it between the fingers you're gonna get stronger healthier fingers right here 
Fun. I want to show you some of the other staffs that I use and how it looks different. Now, the staff that I started this video with was a black staff and it's just red oak on the inside. It's just painted black. This is a graphite staff. It's got my name on it. It was a gift from Buki Yushu. It's BukiYushu.net. I'll look it up and I'll put it in the comment section below. But this is a super fast, extremely durable, lightweight staff that you would use at a competition. For fun and it looks really amazing and it can do a lot of really cool fast stuff this was a gift and I'm very grateful I've had it in storage I just got it out but I wanted to show you so this one here's that one finger finger roll and you can see you can go very quickly you can start to improve your speed here and then you go there's the three finger roll there's the thumb almost lost it on that one there it is this is really good you can go down and go into that pop-up one is rattan there it is, there's that one finger, and then you have, the here's, this one's rattan, so you have the one finger, and then you have the three fingers. This is a little bit heavier. We've got another rattan that's a little bit lighter. That's the great thing about wood is that they're all different weights. And then of course, you're continuous. And this arm's starting to get a little burned out. I don't know if you can see it. That's how you get better though. You go to the point where you feel burned out a little bit. It means the muscles are burning. You feel a burning sensation, that's the lactic acid. It's the muscles getting tight. You go a little bit past your comfort zone. Get out of your comfort zone to grow. The last staff I wanna show you is the Darth Maul staff. I don't know if it's Darth Maul or not, but it's red. It lights up, you turn the lights down, and this thing glows red from side to side. It's really cool to do for demonstrations. Again, this is not for self-defense, it's just for fun. But this is a heavy staff. This is heavier than my white oak staff. So from here, that first roll, remember you gotta get it in motion first, pop it out, put that thumb in, bring it around, and then the two fingers, and then the three fingers, and now continuous. And here we go, I'm starting to get out of my comfort zone here, this really hurts. It hurts in a good way. It hurts isn't the right word. Let's just say I can feel it, I can feel the muscles being challenged and growing, starting to get stronger. And I know that after some rest, I'm gonna have a much stronger grip. Make sure that you do that in both hands. Practice as much as you can. Let me know in the comment section below as soon as you get down all three versions of the finger roll, and I'll see you in the next video.